Good evening, everybody. This is Sweat. And in case you missed yesterday's video, yes, I am sick as a dog, but I am going to press on because I have done pretty well with these gold camouflage weapons, and I've done pretty well using the gold FAL. Now, the gold FAL, again, is a single-shot weapon. This is one of the first weapons that I actually got gold on. I think I started with the AN-94. I think I did the M8A1 next, and, uh, and then I think I did the FAL, the gold FAL after that. Followed by the SMR. It's just been a, um, you know, kind of a revolving door on which which video I decided to post that week or whatever. And I know there's been a few channels that have posted some gold FALs already. Uh, Sergeant Merrill's being one of them. But I want to talk about the gold FAL and kind of how it stacks up compared to the other weapons and and that dreaded OP term that everybody uses that gets thrown around so often in Call of Duty and, uh, and really in these first-person shooter type games in particular. And is this weapon OP? Because the the rate of fire is uh, is pretty high when you once you uh, unlock that selector switch. I know a lot of you guys could probably spam the trigger a hell of a lot faster than I can with the uh, with semi-automatic fire. But the high damage that you already get with this weapon is what really sets it apart. You know, once you start unlocking that really high rate of fire with the uh, with the selector switch, and that's where the the whole overpower term comes from. And uh, in my opinion, I do think that they probably should have done something like uh, like a three-round burst. So they probably should have slowed the fire rate considerably uh, rather than having it as fast as it is. I know a lot of people are going to say, oh, no, there's nothing wrong with it. I do great with it. That might be the problem. Um, and I still think uh, that like any other weapon, like any other really assault rifle in this game, save maybe the Type 25, which I think it seems like it shoots BBs, but it shoots BBs at such an incredibly high rate that it does pretty well. I think most of the assault rifles, this one included, the fire rates are just too slow uh, to, to really do well unless you're, uh, you know, unless you're getting rounds on target immediately and, and the guy that you're shooting at is not shooting at you. If you're, if you're behind cover and, you know, if somebody comes around a corner or something like that, you're generally going to do well. If you meet somebody face-to-face -face in a doorway, he's got an SMG, you've got an assault rifle, he's supposed to win that gunfight. He's supposed to win that engagement anyway. And, uh, and you're really kind of setting yourself, uh, setting yourself up for failure if you're running around with the FAL, even on the selector switch. So is it OP? Eh, I, I think it could be. I really do. I think if you're, if you're head glitching or something like that, uh, I don't think there's really much of a chance if somebody's coming around a corner and doesn't know anything about you, kind of like that guy right there. Um, but as far as running around and doing well with it, I, I think you're, you know, I think that's really one way where you can kind of level the playing field for the other team. Um, so I don't know. If, if it was up to me, it would be a little bit slower rate of fire, or it would be the selector switch would be a burst option instead of a fully automatic option. But again, it's not up to me. The uh, the cards are, are kind of set. You know, the table's kind of set. We'll see what Treyarch can uh, can do with it from here on out. Not quite sure what they're going to look at as far as weapons balancing. Haven't heard much about weapons balancing so far, but uh, but. You know, I don't really think I feel the need to. I know a lot of people saying you got to balance the the SMGs. Not really sure how you do that. I mean, you add one extra bullet to kill for every single one, but that that's that's kind of a bit drastic. And it seems to me that people have figured out the uh, the PDW seems to be the way to go for uh, for SMGs, the high damage PDW. Uh, a lot of rounds in the magazine. Uh, really high fire rate, you know, being an SMG, PDW seems to be the uh, seems to be the weapon that has been doing the most work against me lately. So, hope you guys are enjoying these gold gun videos. I have actually unlocked diamond camouflage for the assault rifles. Really excited about it. Just finished it tonight, uh, or late on the uh, 27th, right before midnight. So I guess still on the 26th. But um, but what I'm doing with that is I'm uh, I'm sending some to Machinima, and I want to upload the some uh, some other ones or a different one right around the same time on my channel plus I want to do some more gold gun videos because uh, I know once I put a diamond video I know you guys aren't gonna give a damn about this gold camouflage so follow me on Facebook or Twitter you can find those links in the description if maybe you want to see a picture or something of the diamond camo of course I'm sure some other people have assault rifles already but uh, but looking forward to bringing some of the first assault rifles uh, in diamond camouflage to YouTube because it really is a grind and I'm really uh, really glad that I made it because it was uh, they, they look pretty sweet I'm gonna be honest with you so in case you guys missed any videos the video on the bottom left is military monday where i answer you guys questions about the military if you're new here i am a former uh former united states marine and uh and those uh questions usually revolve around my marine corps service so video on the bottom right i believe is the gold m8 a1 the four round burst 
assault rifle. So hope you guys enjoy. If you're new here, just click that subscribe button. Other than that, please leave a like on the video if you enjoyed it. It really does help the channel out, and uh, I do really appreciate the support. Thank you guys for watching. Have a great day, and I'll see you again soon.